Let's go, we can go a bit faster, faster. faster. <laughs> Does everyone know what race is? In, that is one kind of race. But we're going to talk about the race that goes in this bin. There's general race and there's recycling. You can see over here all the stuff you can recycle. There's plastic, there's cans. What else do you recycle? Can you recycle paper? You can recycle paper. You can, if it's shredded, you can recycle it with the, uh, either the chicken or you can feed it to the worm. Uh, for the plastic, if it's like, like if it's containers like these, you can put it in the plastic bin. Do you know what soft and noisy plastic is? We like playing with bubble wrap, nice and bubble. That is yeah. So if, if you can squeeze it and it makes noise, if it's soft, you can take it to coal or outside Woolworths and they recycle the plastic to make it into furniture for schools and other places in Australia. Isn't that good? So remember to do that for your soft and noisy plastic stuff. We'll talk more about the race. Uh, let's move on to the worm farm. <laughs> so you can download certain apps which can help you. Um, one of them is the area, the suburb you stay in. You get an app and it'll tell you which bin to use. That's, that's the new big one. Uh, because coffee pods are made of different materials, plastic and some kind of foils, it's very hard to recycle. I think only one company over here does it. It's called a drop, find a local point to drop them off, at, and they will separate all the materials and recycle it. Yes, Heather's. I think it's Heather's store now. Uh, for compost, there's, there's a. Four main things we need. We need uh, brown, we need green, we need enough air and water for the organisms to live in there and break it down. Uh, and I've written down the ratio of the greens and browns that we need to down there. Uh, for the worm farm, there's lots of ways to make the worm farm. I think you'll like this one. Because you are very creative, there's a company called Remida, which collects yeah, they, they collect all kinds of things you throw away, which different artists can use. Wow, very beautiful. You are cute. We can use, run you in the cute machine now. The slow machine. <laughs> so, apart from coffee pot, balloons are another problem. Balloons fly away, somehow they get into the ocean or some animals eat them. And then it causes a lot of problems in the stomach. So you can't live with this kind of stuff. So, yeah, because they think, they think it's the kind of food they eat, like jellyfish, like the snakes. So be careful with your balloon. If you have one, hold on to it with your life. Glue. You could use uh, plastic. Yeah, zip ties. I think I've seen that. What else would you reuse? What have you reused? I think uh, we use clothes. Okay. So, did you hear that, guys? Soil. Making, taking care of the soil is the most important. In biodynamic farming, they use a different way where they use cow manure and they, yeah so it's similar to composting but it's with cow manure and he turns it into a putty which is mixed with water and then spread around the soil to make it better okay 
Now the train, the train's going to go, go to its final stop. Are you ready? Let's go. Ouch. Ouch. Ouch.